Welcome to Burger Proof, I'm Mary. And I'm Lillian. And this week we'll be testing Kylie Cosmetics liquid lipsticks. Against the Impossible Burger from Fat Burger. Shh, it's vegan. We're gonna be testing this a velvet liquid lipstick and it's in the color Vibe. Ooh, I like that, it looks neutral. Do you think it looks like the color Vibe? Like what you would imagine to be the color Vibe? No, when I think Vibe, I think neon. Yeah, me too. It's you do? Of, yes, I, I do, not I do that. that. Vibe can mean anything these days. Yeah, that's so true. People say it a lot, but it was $17, which I think okay. is like, it's an okay price, but the shipping, $6. So you can't buy this in stores? No. Okay, it's only online. Only online. Good to know. Shipping viewers. is $6 though. <laughs> but this is also <laughs> vegan, which is good for Lillian because she's a vegan. She's I a am. vegan. Yeah, sorry. If I didn't tell you, she would have told you. <laughs> Just kidding. That's what vegans do. <laughs> People really claim that this is the best lipstick, the liquid lipstick. Really? Yeah, people really, really like it. So, I don't know. Have you tried it before? I have actually not tried any Kylie products. Wow. Like, ever. Which is crazy, because I'm like a makeup girl. So let's find out if it's burger proof. Burger -proof. I'm nervous. Last time I did this, I hit my tooth. <laughs> okay, not gonna lie. Not the best color on me. I'll let you know in a minute. Oh God. What? It kind of looks like a poofy color. First impressions on you, it looks quite orange. <laughs> I feel like it looks poofy. Not poofy though, but like pretty orange. Pretty orange, poofy. Initial thoughts, I'm like, I don't know, but it does have to dry it on a bit more, so we'll see. But why don't you give it a go? Yeah, let's do this. It's probably gonna look better on Lillian. Oh, stop. Now, do you scrape off the excess? I did a wee bit there. Ooh. It, it smells, smells like okay. dessert. It does, doesn't it? It's all right. I secretly like when makeup smells like that. Yeah, because... yeah, yeah. I do too. It's like the fat um, primer smells can amazing. Can you hold that? Yes. It makes you just like want to eat, like lick the lipstick off your lips. And Kylie has big lips. That's probably why she did it, because she can just snack on her lips. Okay, here we go. It looks nice on Lillian. I so far, so good. <laughs> Honestly, this is like the most Kardashian color. Is it? I, I, like I feel like it's a very Kardashian color. And like, why is that? I don't know. I just could see Kim rocking this with her babies in tow. And Kylie's baby in tow. <laughs> it takes me a while. <laughs> yeah, it takes you a long time. I have a lot of lip that I need to cover. Humble brag. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> it is kind of a vibe though. Lily, it looks so good on you. You think so? Yeah. First impressions, I've never worn a lip color like this, but I'm not opposed. It's nice because it has like a dark moodiness to it, but it's not like a red, it's not a plum, it's an orange, which is really interesting and very different. It is very different. Because like from a distance, it could look red. Yeah, 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 but up close, but it's up like- But up close, it's a really interesting color. It is, you know, I actually do like it. You know, I started off thinking negative, but I think I grew into it. I like know. it, I like it on you. Mm. And I like it on me. <laughs> no, I like it on you too. <laughs> so far, Kylie, you kind of nailed it. I like the texture too. Yeah, it's not sticky. I feel like I'm in Vogue or something. It's like, uh, who is she? Well, maybe we should take out this burger and give it a go. Now, I do have to say, I feel like this went on really smooth and yeah. it seems really soft, so I'm wondering if it's gonna move. Like, it doesn't seem like it's gonna be a stain, but it also doesn't claim to be a stain. Yeah, yeah, but it is oh. supposed to be like a long wearing liquid lipstick. <sighs> Alright, right. And long wearing, I'm a modern woman, and I think that a modern woman does modern woman things, like yeah. eats in between long R's. So I hope. Modern women eat. Modern women eat. This is the coolest I've ever looked. Let's get started on the burger. This is the Impossible Burger from Fat Burger. It's a vegan burger, and Lillian's vegan. <laughs> so. And this burger with the gluten-free bun is ten twenty-five. Which is kind of steep, but you know, it's okay for a vegan burger, I guess. Yeah, because all burgers in, our, in LA are like at least over $10. That's so true. Like a minimum. You've had this burger before, haven't you? I have had this burger twice before. Twice! Now, I've got to tell you, the last time that I had this, I was halfway through eating it and I had to stop because I was convinced that it was real meat and I threw it away. I was convinced that they screwed it up like the restaurant <laughs> and this actually looks like real beef so I'm not even convinced right now. Because yeah. it's impossible. It's impossible. Uh, vegan, I have been for a short time of my life but I love a good beef burger so it's going to be a little harder to impress me I think. 
We're gonna find out if Kylie Jenner's liquid lipstick is burger proof against this. Hold on. I gotta take out the tomatoes. The tomatoes And too? the pickles! Oh, oh Mary! My God. Hold on. Do you have any ketchup? I'm not getting you ketchup. <laughs> That's not a true taste test. Oh, is it not? Okay. Uh -uh. Okay, wait for me. Oh, that must go. This tastes like beef. I'm freaking out again. Oh, no, shit. it's not beef. It's not beef. It's impossible. Wait, so you would know because you eat meat still. And I love a good burger. <laughs> As if I've never had meat in my life. This is so yummy though. But I do. I can tell that it's not beef. You made such a mess there. I'm picky. Do you like this? It's really good, right? Mm hmm So, um, Kylie, mm -hmm. the maker of this lipstick worn today, mm -hmm. just had a baby. Did you hear about this? <laughs> did I hear about this? Wait, do you follow Kylie? Of course I do. She's an American, um, what's that word? What, what do I call Chrissy Teigen all the time? Treasure, an American treasure. Kylie Jenner is an American treasure. And when I heard she had a baby, I watched video. that video and I cried. The video. And I don't even, you know what, I'll actually be real. I actually don't follow her. I just, what? so many people tagged me in the post. You followed her on Snapchat for a really long yeah, time. Yeah, but the only reason I don't follow her on Instagram is because when I look at her pictures, it makes me feel really bad about myself. So those are some unrealistic beauty standards, even though she does rain. Yeah, I take really big bites. I've just, I discussed that in the last episode, but mm. roll that clip. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> What do you think about Stormy's last name being her father's last name? Um, not about it. She bore it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't know. I guess it's up to them. Have you heard that her former guy, Tyga? Yeah, he's like claiming that he's the dad. <laughs> That's psycho, dude. So, what do you think about the name Stormy? I kind of like it. It just goes well with a lot of things and like other people's names like her cousin's names like what like i heard it was a stormy night in northwest chicago on st patrick's day that it was a dream <laughs> lillian what is that what you've been thinking about all night <laughs> did you get it yeah i get it <laughs> Now for the first impressions. It did not do good, you know. It's partly on my nose. Oh my god. Move that way more. Oh yeah, it is like it's a mess. The whole inside of your lips are it's gone. gone. It's just on the outside, and it's come out beyond the lip line. It kind of looks like a it looks like a questionable piece of anatomy, but I'll leave it to your imagination. What do you think? Oh. It's still all great for you. Well, except in the inner part. The inner like, part is totally gone. Which, from a distance, you might not be able to tell, but up close, it looks horrible. But did you like it? Do you feel, though, that you could live with that? Or I, I mean, have to touch up yeah, right but, after. What about the burger? The burger was really good. I really liked the burger, too, and I'm not even vegan. It, I did. I really liked it. It was really nice. It's pretty meaty, right? Yeah, it is. Like, it, it's pretty realistic. It's pretty good. How would you rate this lipstick out of 10? Well, I want to say, like, a 6. A 6 out of 10. Really didn't stay on well and it actually did make my face more messy so I would give this lipstick a 5 out of 10. <laughs> but I did like the color. No hate Kylie. Kylie's lipstick it's is not burger proof. Mm. Kylie, it's no hate to you. You're very young. You're you very so much young. to learn. <laughs> <laughs> the makeup world is just growing for you, Kylie. Yeah, I mean... Buckle up, sister. There's some girls with small lips that need some lipsticks. Exactly. And see, like, since we're older than you, we can give you advice. Do you still think, though, that, like, regardless of it not being burger proof, that you would wear it again? Yeah. She would wear it again? I would. The burger was burger proof approved. Wow. Thanks for watching Burger Proof. Subscribe for bi monthly videos. And let us know what you want us to review next. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. <laughs>